आगे चलते हैं तो आज हम एक स्टूडेंट से पहले बात करेंगे स्टूडेंट की क्या है भावनाएं अपने देश को लेकर के इस सिचुएशन को लेकर के पहले वो जान लेते हैं हेलो हेलो सर जी आपको मेरी आवाज आ रही है आप अपना नाम बताना चाहेंगे I I understand your concern, Elena. Elena, I, I do understand your concern. I I do understand how you are worried about your future, and I am also worried about your future. Would you like to tell me, Elena, what you want to be? Well, I want to be an entrepreneur. Sir. Entrepreneur. I want to do something that has never been done in Manipur. I want to bring wellness in our Manipur, in our Manipur, in our city. And uh, what is the current situation, Elena? Do you really want to study? and in this situation also yeah if a single day is wasted it means a single day of knowledge is wasted so i do understand and then i it is very sad it's very hurtful that i had spent my two months without knowing nothing all all i know about is gun people dying crying screaming people burning their houses people burning other houses that's all i have learned in this two months so really bad it's very scary i think it's really scary okay. i'm afraid how this world gonna end but and after how this conflict will be concluded alina if you if you want to say something to the prime minister directly what will be the what will be your words oh the thing that i want to say to the prime minister is that uh, why he has not done a thing about us the He is showing that he does not care about us. All he does care about is both political. Alina, but uh, we can see like like what we can see right now from that Manipur uh, might be that is a half truth, half lie. But uh, there are so many uh, forces are there. They deploy so many forces. So what they are doing? actually i am just saying you that uh, like as we can see here uh, with the platform with the different platform with the different news channel that they are uh, they are showing the some videos some steps like the people are there gather with the army people is also there a uh, government had deploy army people over there they are not doing anything yeah, for you guys the government people, uh, the army that the government people deployed that they are doing nothing all they are doing is helping the cooking militants and we Like all the military uh, people, all the women, the Maya Saiti, uh, they are protesting day by day, day after day since the war. But I guess our protest was just 
the name of it. There is nothing acting on it. Like, they are not hearing us of it. So, what can we do? All I just heard, uh, up till my grief, is now that government is a, ter- uh, is a servant of the public. But in this case, I don't think it is. We are the servant of government in this case. I do understand so your concern. Is, it's really scary that no one is listening you out. And no one is doing anything for you guys. And I'm really very sorry for that. And your education is like very important. Our Pradhan Mantri says, Son, study, 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 ऑनलाइन स्टडी करने को भी तैयार है बट इंटरनेट है ही नहीं पता नहीं कुकीज को कैसे इंटरनेट मिल जा रहा है दैट इज क्वेश्चनेबल कहां से मिल जा रहा है इंटरनेट कैसे मिल रहा है हेलो यप जी या आई थिंक यू हैव नाउ हेलो या देयर आर सम अनकंफर्म न्यूज़ दैट दे आर यूजिंग स्किन फ्रॉम द म्यांमार फॉर दैट व्हाई दे आर गेटिंग द इंटरनेट सर्विस ओके दे आर दे आर यूजिंग द सिम फ्रॉम द म्यांमार Yes, sir. Is it the perfect news? Like, is it the correct news you are telling me out? This is unconfirmed news, but uh, okay, that is unconfirmed. But as like you, you have a like you have a thought like they are using from there only. That's why they are getting the internet. This is not uh, this is not coming from my thought, but all the people are saying like this uh, because uh, internet has been banned since part of May. So still they are using. No, I do understand. In the month, the month of um, uh, middle. Of they are internet is provided in the chiratampur district and uh, later somehow it was disconnected but still they are getting internet specifically so uh, many people they are saying that they are using some kind of features in that uh, uh, they can access internet very easily i do understand this concern of yours like how they are getting internet is so <clears throat> like mysterious thing right now but what about anything else like what about anything else like why because it's like now the date is change okay the date is change now it's 14th of july is there anything else they are going they are doing like government any notification regarding this when it will be start stop or anything like that is there any notification to you guys is there any notification from the government like when it will be stop like when you will get the internet when the peace will be there is there any notification you guys are getting yeah please uh, first I, i have to introduce myself first but uh, that that idea of internet came to my mind and i just interrupted uh, actually i'm not getting your voice clearly so uh, can you just uh, pick your mic to uh, uh, to your face or something like Your voice is not clear. Yes, sir. Can you hear me now, sir? Yeah, I can hear you now. Please. Okay. So, uh, for my side, uh, uh, actually, this is the second time uh, I am participating in this, your program. Uh, what I want to say, I've already mentioned in my earlier uh, session also, but today also, I just want to say that the central government, they should be very honest and sincere. They should be... Uh, transparency because uh, still now we don't know whether article 355 is um, uh, accepted on the state or not even though there is no president rule but it, it, it seems to us like president rule is already in there in the state because the uh, state minister cannot uh, act uh, cannot act fully he is yeah. not fully functional because yeah. unified command is not given to him Yeah. So he cannot command uh, to all the central paramilitary forces. So what what is exactly happening in the state of Manipur? So we are still confused. So uh, I just want to uh, say to the Prime Minister Modi and Home Minister Amita, if they could hear uh, hear us, that uh, they may be good in other field also, but they are totally collapsed in the internet security because uh, India is known uh, as the largest democracy in the world, right? and yeah. he's, uh, he is also running for uh, fourth rank in the superpower but uh, okay. i don't know what is still happening here so there are also some unconfirmed report that during the time of elections 
so he gets some kind of financial support to the government and uh, Amitwadi also uh, claimed that uh, I will fulfill all your demands once BJP comes to power. It was also published in the Times of India 2017. Okay. So, uh, so in, in return, has the government of India promised something to the Kuki people? This is my question. So uh -huh. there has been some kind of understanding between the government of India and the Kuki people. The promises. So what is the agenda behind? So we don't, we don't, we have no uh, actual idea. Uh, uh, since it seems like since the third of May, uh, still violence is being going on, and those that are military forces, they are not acting. They should be uh, either neutral or they should not be biased. But they are always uh, helping the militants. So on the foothill, on the hill side, you can see from the drone, there are lots of bunkers. Yeah, they are bunkers are gaining their